Welcome back. It is still Thursday, May 28, 2020. Um, I forgot when I was doing the lesson on Comets 9 Lives to hold these up. If you looked in your yellow folder, you should have seen these Sailor's Valentine bookmarks. So you have five. Um, this is what I was talking about if you were unsure. Um, color these with your markers, keep one for yourself, and give the others away um, to family members to use for bookmarks. If you have a little laminator at home, ask mom um, to laminate those for you, and those will protect them. If we had been in school, I would have done that for you. So I apologize for not being able to do that for you today. But these are, you will find them in your green folder. So this lesson is nature poetry, lesson number five. And yesterday we filled in this worksheet on emotions. And I asked you to make sure that you complete these in complete sentences. So I feel happy when I get to see my children. I feel sad when I can't see my children. I feel angry when students complete their work and it isn't their best quality. I feel excited when I'm going on a trip. And I feel bored when there's nothing on TV that I want to watch. So now, today, you're going to pick one of those. You're going to pick one of those and write about it. So, the one that I chose to write about. So I'm going to put this right over next door. Um, I am going to write about when I feel sad. Finding the right marker. Okay. So, today I feel sad. Okay. So step one was check in with your emotions. Step two, um, is choose one emotion and write about those feelings. Take the time to write down why they feel that way and what you can do when you feel that way. So how do you feel and what to do when you feel that way to help yourself. So here we go. Today, I feel sad because, oh, right up the edge. I can't visit. Heather or Grant in person. I want to hug them Okay, because that's something I can't do because I can't touch them. So this is how I feel. Today I feel sad because I can't visit Heather or Grant in person. I want to hug them. So when I feel this way, it helps. to FaceTime with them so I can at least, wait a minute, when I feel this way, it helps to FaceTime with them so I can at least see them 
and talk. And I ran out of room, so I'm going to flip it over and write it on the back. Now I used a Sharpie, so it's going to go through. Yours shouldn't. So today I feel sad because I can't visit Heather or Grant in person. I want to hug them. When I feel this way, it helps to FaceTime with them so I can at least see them and talk to them. Okay? So you're picking one of your emotions over here. And then you are going to write about it. You're going to explain it. And you're going to tell what you could do to help yourself feel better. Now, if you're angry, you might say, my face gets all red and my eyes crinkle up. And you could explain what you look like as well. But when I'm just sad, so oh, this is when I really miss... Mrs. Arenas. That's not bad for me. So this is me being sad, okay? Um, but remember, you are telling me how you feel, why you feel that way, and what can you do to make yourself feel better, okay? And then you're going to send me a picture. Now, if you're writing a lot, ask your mom to print up another one of these. Uh, if you want to use the lines. Otherwise, I have no problem with you writing and finishing on the back. Like I said, I used a Sharpie so you can see it on the back. If you use a pencil, you will not be able to see it on the back and it will not be a problem. Okay, I'll see you in a little while for math.